Good evening, good evening. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Pro Wrestling Talk video brought to you by Blitzball Champ Gaming here on the U to the Tube. My name is Blitzball Champ Jason Ingram. So, I wanted to get on here and talk about more Sukeban, the new Joshi Pro Wrestling promotion that is actually getting ready to have its first show Thursday, September 21st at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Wanted to talk about this. They also have a card. They have the card set. And it's very interesting how they're going about this. Very interesting. Um, while you're at it, be sure to, whenever you get a chance, to check out the link in the description for Game Beauty for an awesome lineup of video game themed makeup and cosmetic products. Um, and don't forget to use the promo code blitzball underscore champ to get 10% off. All in caps with the underscore, you can get 10% off of your order. So be sure to use that. So, a couple of things here. One, September 21st, Thursday, is technically um, as of now, tomorrow. But yeah, 8 p.m. Here's the interesting thing. This will be live streamed on TikTok. Now, when I first heard about this, when I first saw the announcement about this, I'm like, okay, maybe I just don't know much about TikTok, but I I didn't think you could even do live streams from TikTok. But like I said, I don't have TikTok. I don't use TikTok, so I wouldn't know. But I find it very interesting that this this show is going to be streamed on on TikTok. Not only that, the card is only five matches. Hmm. I mean, but then again, the roster is not big, so I I kind of understand. You know, the, ro the roster is not big, so I, I do understand. But then again, the whole vibe that I get from this Sukeban uh, pro, res uh, pro Wrestling promotion, the Sukeban Joshi Pro Wrestling promotion, it kind of gives me that vibe of a mix of anime, uh, glow, and even a little bit of Lucha Underground. That's that's the vibe that I get from this, especially from the presentation of the trailers that they've showed, especially the trailers that they've showed for a lot of the different wrestlers on this roster. Um, but something that I came across uh, that might have something to do with why this is being live streamed on TikTok. So shout out to uh, uh, at Scott E. Wrestling uh, on X. Uh, very interesting breakdown here. So, and I'll share, I'll share the, the tweet uh, in the description. But he says, and I quote, Looking into the decision to choose TikTok as the platform for Sukeban's world premiere, Sukeban currently has 17.8K followers on, on the TikTok app. Their very first video ever on, on their TikTok got 2.8 million views. And then they have other videos on their TikTok roster intro videos, which uh, had 705.1K and 387.3K views. Uh, the Harujuku stars themselves, uh, 
379.9k views. Ancham and uh, slash babyface 305.2k views. Um, Owie slash midnight player got 288.4k views. I mean, to keep it real with you, after looking at those stats, I can kind of understand why they went with TikTok as the platform. I can, I can understand. I mean, when you got that many views, I mean, you already have 17.8K followers. And even, like, the first video with 2.8 million views, that, that says something. So, I guess we really can't be surprised that this first event's gonna be live streamed via TikTok. Now, I'm gonna tell you right now, I would like to see this. I, I don't wanna have to get a TikTok account just to see this. So I really hope, I really hope they have some sort of idea of what they're gonna do for archives going forward. Cause I just, I really don't want to go to the lengths of getting a TikTok just to see this. You know what I mean? I already do enough with the social media with Facebook, X, and and YouTube, and, and Instagram. I, I, I feel like I, I have enough. I feel like I have enough. You know, I just really didn't have any plans to, to ha add TikTok on the list. You know what I mean? Ugh. But... That's, that's the platform that they're going for, but I mean, how many of y'all use TikTok? I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of people that have, uh, that have tip TikTok, but to those out there that don't have TikTok, would you actually be willing to get one to watch the show? Especially the, the Joshi Pro Wrestling fans out there. Uh, I don't know, and and that and that's why like I'm not so quick to do a, an official preview on the show because I don't want it to be one of those where I have to get a TikTok account in order to in order to watch. But we'll see. That's that's all I can say. But I do understand the idea of why they're letting this be the platform for them to do the live stream. Because it's going to get views. It's going to get attention. So I get it. I totally get it. Also, they do have the card up, which I will also share in the des uh, description. But yeah, so the card is up. And... It's only five matches. It's only five matches. So, let's see. We have a we have a trios match. It's the Cherry Bomb Girls versus the Vandals. And also have the full roster up. <coughs> uh, excuse me. Pardon me. Sorry about that. Um, Cherry Bomb Girls versus the Vandals. So the Cherry Bomb Girls, it's Crush You, Supersonic, and Rico Blonde, which which are, I don't know who Supersonic is. Crush You is you. And Rico Blonde is uh, Rico Kaiju. So it's pretty much whoever Supersonic is, Rico Kaiju and uh, you taking on the Vandals, uh, Atomic Banshee, o Otaku Chan, and Bingo. Which Bingo, I'm not sure who Bingo is is supposed to be. Uh, Atomic Banshee is Ram Kaicho, and o 
Otaku-chan is uh, Kaori Yoniyama. So, the Vandals, whoever Bingo is, Kaori Yoniyama, and Ram Kaicho. So, battle, battle of factions here. But yeah, trios match. Then you have a special attraction three-way match, uh, which is Saki Bimi versus Queen Takase versus X. So, let's see. Saki Bimi, which I don't see on here. Yeah, don't see her on here. Uh, Queen Takase, which I assume... Oh, the Queen of Hearts. Queen of Hearts. So that's Miyuki Takase. But I don't know who... I don't know who Saki Bimi is. But... And then X is, you know, a mis mystery, mystery competitor. So... So yeah, triple threat match there. Uh, we got a special singles match. Midnight Player versus Stray Cat, which Midnight Player is Aoi, of course, from Just Tap Out. Stray Cat, which I believe is Tomoka Inaba. She, she's masked. She's in a mask, but I believe it's uh, Tomoka Inaba. So it's essentially... Aoi versus Tomoka Inaba, which is funny because they're both from Just Tap Out. So, you know, those two have, you know, faced each other and teamed up with each other so many times. But they're going to be in character at this Sukiban show. So, interesting, eh? Uh, we got a tag team match as well. We got the Harajuku Stars versus the Dangerous Liaisons. So the Harajuku stars are uh, Maya, Mamushi, and Babyface, which are, I believe, Ancham. I think that's Ancham. I think that's Ancham. Uh, Ancham and uh, Maya Yukihi. And they'll be taking on Dangerous Liaisons, which is Commander Nakajima and Lady Antoinette. Which Commander Nakajima is Arisa Nakajima. Lady Antoinette is uh, Risa Sarah. So, tag team match there. And then, the main event, Title Eliminator. So, apparently, this match is to determine, I guess, who's going to have the opportunity to compete for the, I guess, Sukiban World Championship, which I believe is supposed to go down at the next show or something like that. But it's going to be Countess Sayori versus Ichigo Sayaka, which Countless Sayori is uh, Sayori Ano, and Ichiko Sayaka is um, Unagi Sayaka, which is interesting because I thought she was still, I thought she was still injured. I thought she was injured for some reason, or maybe she's cleared. I don't know, but uh, that's your main event match. So, like I said, only five matches, and. And I know some folks may be wondering, why only five matches? Wow, only five matches? I mean, they only have a 15, 15 wrestler roster. I mean, they got 15 ladies on their roster currently, according to their website. So, I mean, you could only have but so many matches, you know, especially looking at the card. The card has variety because, I mean, you have a trios match. You have a triple threat match. You have a you have two singles matches, and you have a tag team match. So at least there's some variety there. You know, there's some variety. Not bad for a five match card, but we have to also remember 
you know, these are going to be ladies that we're used to seeing totally in a different different characters. You know, you is going to be crush you. You know, Rico Kaiju, Rico Blondie. You know, uh, Arisa Nakajima is going to be Commander Nakajima. You know, Risa Sarah, Aunt Lady Antoinette. You know, we have to keep in mind these ladies that we're so used to seeing are going to be in a totally different totally different characters for this show. So it really makes me wonder like how different, how unique are they going to be uh versus, you know, who they normally are in the ring elsewhere. You know what I mean? But But yeah, so this happens tomorrow. This will be in New York. Uh New York City, uh, Sukiban World Premiere, Thursday, September 21st, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, and tickets for this event sold out in like two hours, so it sold out pretty quick. Uh, how do I think this will do? I mean, I don't know. I've been hearing all sorts of mixed things on social media. Uh, I'm definitely interested in seeing how this show goes, especially if they ever come to North Carolina. I, I hope they do. I would totally go. But, you know, a lot of folks are saying that they got a bad feeling that this is going to fall flat. And it, maybe it will. Um, I think this is definitely aiming, you know, at a crowd of pro wrestling fans, especially... Joshi fans, this is this is pretty much going to be, I would say, their instant cup of tea. But I don't know. I'm pretty, I'm pretty confident in the in its presentation. Just what I've seen, like from trailers and stuff like that. I mean, it looks like it's going to have a pretty dang on good presentation. And with it already having so many views, there's definitely interest. There's definitely interest a whole lot of interest but I mean I hope it I hope it goes well um I can't really where's my water I can't really see that's that's another thing because I don't know I don't really know about TikTok uh, one second. I don't really know about how TikTok works. Like, with this being a live stream, is it going to get archived? Like, does TikTok do archives of live stream? Like, I mean, because honestly, I don't, I don't know if I'll, I'll be catching this at eight, because you know, I'll be coming home from working out, but. I just, I don't know. I don't know. Hopefully, some way, somehow, it'll get archived somewhere. But like I said, I don't know how TikTok works. I don't know if they do archives or whatnot. I'm already not too thrilled about the idea of getting a TikTok account just to watch this. So, but who knows? I mean, I hope it goes well. I, I want it to be a success. But... I don't know. There's 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 definitely a few things that kind of attract me about this promotion. And then there's some that is just like, uh, it just there it's just head scratcher. But I mean small card, but there's variety in the the types of matches. So Hopefully, I get a chance to see it at some point if I don't get to catch it tomorrow, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Uh, that's pretty much all that I have uh, on this, but let me know what y'all's thoughts are. 
Uh, don't forget to check out the links in the description uh, that you can be able to see uh, the the information, uh, the TikTok information uh, from Scott uh, E. Wrestling's post. And also, I have the link in the description. That way you can see the card. Uh, but yeah, let me know what y'all's thoughts are. I mean, are y'all excited about Sukiban? Uh, do y'all plan on watching the live stream via TikTok? I mean, do y'all have TikTok? What do y'all think of the card? Uh, do you think this promotion will be a success? Any red flags that you see? Let me know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell while you're at it. And thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. For another pro wrestling talk brought to you by Blitzball Champ Gaming here on the U to the Tube. My name is Blitzball Champ Jason Ingram. Everybody have a blessed evening, and I will see y'all in the next video. Take care. Peace.